I don't know. Like it's just it's still just like two hits and you're dead. So. All right, so, All right, so we got Pikachu versus Brakeson. All right, NC Jacob T versus I don't know anyone's names in the scene yet. So that's exactly uh, what me and Pluto were saying. Like I wish I, I could talk to you about these players like I knew them. But well, NC Jacob T is a Smash player. He mains Pikachu or main sort of. But Pikachu is his favorite character. So. Yeah, and he, he didn't even enter Smash today. Man, that's so. Yeah. I feel like that's a lot of a lot of Smashers today. They're just hyped on this game. So I was watching Jacob play. And uh, he, he's pretty decent. He's pretty good. Wow, that beat. Uh, I mean, he's this, he's made it this far. He's still in the winners bracket. So. Yeah, but I mean, it's basically that. random seeding, so we don't really know like true anything. <laughs> but it's still. So when you do thunders like that, and you're at that range, you can literally just hit X, hold shield, wait for him to land, and then X X it, and then just you can get your melee attacks off easy. He has a ton of lag after thunder. Now I'm interested to see with how Jacob can deal with this fireball spam, besides. Uh, counter canceling, which maybe he's gonna just do that. He's just walking up and shielding for now. Yeah, which uh, isn't, isn't gonna work. Yeah, he's uh, he has no idea how to deal with this right now. Yeah, I don't, he probably hasn't played any uh, breaks in and this this. Oh, that was great. He uh, got in there early. This breaks is actually pretty, pretty good. good. Oh wow. Oh, I think he dropped something right there. But even even so, like when you're in a combo like that, you're not gonna get that much more damage off. Do the combo scaling. All right, that was great for Celia. He'll recover all of his uh, recoverable, recoverable HP. HP. Yeah. Now well, that was 127. He just got off. All right, one good hit. Yeah. All right, interested. Oh wow, that beat that. And he still got he still got burst, but he's probably gonna want to yeah, save uh, that. Yeah. yeah, he might as well save it. I was I was wondering if he was gonna go for it, but he didn't really need to. Yeah. He t he, he I thought it. maybe the Bryson would have because it heals you. Mm -hmm. And uh, when when she's in uh, burst mode and she throws those fireballs, it's so incredibly hard to deal with. Oh, okay. She, the Bryson did wake up counter, and Jacob read that really hard. Okay. Good get off me. Um, well, Bryson's countered just three times in a row here, so that was a good. Well, good burst. Point. Good burst. This is one of the. That's one of the weakest Pikachu's. I think Pikachu's might be the weakest. His uh, synergy burst. Yeah, I think Chandelure's can be the weakest if you don't land all the hits uh, on his startup, but. Pikachu's is the weakest overall. Ah, uh, this, this is just a win. I feel like that's uh, pretty fair considering Pikachu's uh, overall pretty has pretty solid options. Yeah, he's great. So this is also one of the weakest first in the game. It's uh, a little bit stronger than Shandler. Or it might be the same as Shandler's, but it all hits. It always hits all of its damage, which is nice. So he went for Castelli right there. I think it was just because he felt like, well, this is a good opportunity to use it. I don't know if I'll have another opportunity. So he, he gained about 60 HP back, which is like pretty smart. Okay, so Fennekin will make you invulnerable. But yeah, I know like on Chandler, I'll back up and just uh, hex them. I don't really know the option feature you have. Counter attack. Yeah, Jacob played really well. I don't think he did anything amazing Pikachu wise, but he definitely was just reading his opponent. He's just reading his opponent, yeah. beating him in the rock, paper, scissors. Yeah. Which is huge. Uh, if you can just beat. Uh, someone in the rock, paper, scissors consistently, it's, you don't even need to combo, really. Yeah, you really don't. You could just keep beating them. All right, um, they both stay in characters. You know, I don't really know. I see Brightons do different supports online, and I don't know which one would be the best at all. I hope I don't lose to DJ. I mean, I'm going to be salty. Play your best. I know. It's still winners, right? Yeah, but I'd rather not go through losers. Well, I do get more matches then. More experience. It's a, like this is my first time not playing in my room on my couch, so it's kind of like it's a different experience altogether. Definitely. It's like there's not many high stakes on the rank matches. Well, I guess like at a higher rank, you'll lose 150 points, gain 25, so it's still like you have to try really hard. But uh, in this, it's just a whole nother ball game. Yeah, you're playing for the money here. Yeah, Bryson did the same start he did round one last game, which is just run and shoot, and it looks like Pikachu just beats that. So I wouldn't, I would definitely mix that up moving forward. Well, Jacob just did the same thing four times, and it and paid it off. <laughs> yeah, Bryson's not really finding an answer. Yeah, he just he's backed himself in the corner. He doesn't have something like overheat to get him out. So I don't really know what his plan is. Oh, that was a great read. If we get him back in a field phase, like Bryson needs to dominate in the field phase. 
every time Pikachu uses Thunder, you have to punish him hard for that. He can charge, as long as you sidestep it, you can charge whenever you want to hit him. That thing has a ton of life. That was a great anti-air, let him really hard. I, I would, right to the ring, yeah, just be using these fireballs because they're super hard to deal with. And especially for everyone's new to the game, so it's like, it's somewhat difficult to just like know exactly how to get past this stuff. Yeah. yeah, and it's like, it's just a non-committal option by Brighton. It could be red with Thunder, but like, see right there, like, if she hadn't committed to running uh, weak hits, she could have punished right too hard. Projectiles. That was yeah. very smart. Very smart burst. Um, this should push him back, and see like, Chandelier right there, I would have just got a... Wow, I, he That's definitely had time to shield. I don't know. If, if he he might have inputted something, but he might have just been holding R. Hey, you like that giant fist though? That Pikachu you never knew Pikachu had? No, it's kind of creepy. <laughs> yeah, I agree. <laughs> but hey, man, he's got it. All right, so okay, Bright should mix it up. He didn't just uh, okay. See, like okay, he did get a punish. That, there's so much lag on that thunder. People need to realize that. I, I, the most of the, most of the Braxton's I play online do that air dock a lot and don't try to zone as much, whereas this Braxton is purely trying to zone. It's not really working out, but I don't really know. I'm not like a Braxton master or anything, but that's just what I see online. The air dock is so tricky with the, you can double dash. You can charge up and somebody starts countering when you dash over them. You can just, uh, you can like charge it up. It'll like beat their counter. So it's like, it's super good. You can just come in on people. Alright, Jacob's not like, giving him any room to breathe at all. Yeah, this is not looking good. He's kind of wiggling in his chair. I think uh, he kind of gave up here. See, this Cresselia is kind of worthless. I don't know why he's even running Cresselia. He already had burst, and Cresselia builds burst. So it's like... I have no idea why he would go... Oh, I think that's it. Yeah, too much lag on that. It's over. That's it. Yeah, Jacob won. Quick 2-0. I think good. that was a... Uh, was that winner's round four? I feel like that's the easiest winner's round four on the bracket. Hey, man. I, I, that Braxton uh, is pretty good. I saw him play earlier.